how to clock out one or more persons from your storm event. Click on event operations, time and attendance, and click on the event edit clock out tab. From this screen, scroll over and type in clocked in. This way, your list only displays those persons who are currently clocked in to your storm event. Click one or multiple persons to clock out. Once you have your individuals selected, click on the clock out button and notice that you have a checkbox with an option. The first option is to use the existing date and time that appears on each person's individual shift record when you initially clock them in. So if you clocked in somebody from 6 a.m. and they were to work till 6 p.m., 6 p.m. already appears on their shift. If you want to use what is already on their shift, simply click on the submit button. If you want to change what is on their shift, for example if they are clocking out earlier than expected, change the time and click on the box which says it will use the above date and time when you're clocking out those persons selected. Click on the Submit button and now your persons have been clocked out using the 2 o'clock time frame as opposed to the 4 o'clock time frame that I used on the prior screen. They no longer appear on your clocked in list so if you want to review click clocked out and then look at each employee. Notice the two o'clock time frame in which they were clocked out.